Hi, my name is Rich Levin Savage. I'm a world history teacher at Sutton Memorial High School in Sutton, Massachusetts. Go Sammies, go Susies. And I'm going to tell you one of my favorite history stories. The story is about getting a monkey off your back. And let's say the monkey was the size of the Titanic. Have you heard about the Titanic? Well, there was an officer by the name of Charles Lightoller on the Titanic. He was the second officer. And needless to say, the Titanic sunk. And Charles always felt bad about that. He survived. He was a member of the crew. So he really felt bad about that. He felt as though he didn't do his job. So he went through life. He fought in World War I in the British Navy. Um, and he retired. He bought a yacht called the Sundowner. And he just had this thing. Just, just, just The Titanic was bothering him and bothering him and bothering him. So one day, the end of May, 1940, a bunch of British soldiers come over and they try to commandeer his ship. They say, we need this to rescue a bunch of people over in Dunkirk. You may have heard about the miracle of Dunkirk. Well, Charles Lightoller said, you can't go, you can't take my ship unless I go with you. So he feels he's gonna be able to redeem himself and help out in this terrible situation. Well, he takes his yacht over to France, to Dunkirk, and his yacht, was only, uh, could fit about 21 people. So Charles goes over there underneath a, uh, a, a Navy escort, loads people on his boat, says, keep on coming, keep on coming, keep on coming, keep on coming, get on here, get on here. He gets his boat, he takes his yacht across the English Channel, and at this point he does not have a Navy um, escort, so he's on his own, and his ship is very, very heavy from all the people on there, and he's going through, he's getting shot at by German airplanes, um, you know, he's, he's being chased, and eventually he gets over, all the way over back to England, um, and they start unloading the men, the soldiers from Dunkirk, and as he comes off, they're counting them, and they're counting them. Now, don't forget, that yacht was only supposed to hold 21 people. How many people do you think he rescued at Dunkirk that day? 127 people. So he was more than 100 people over capacity for his yacht. Very, very remarkable situation. He felt vindicated. He felt he redeemed himself. Again, Dunkirk was uh, a battle during World War II, and uh, many of the Allied forces had been surrounded by the Germans, uh, and the only way to get out was through the water, and that's when the British government uh, uh, created this plan called Operation Dynamo, known as the Miracle of Dunkirk and several hundred thousand Allied forces were saved due to the help of people like Charles Lightola and his Sundowner yacht. He was redeemed, the monkey is now off his back.